Sup guys, it's me. <laughs> what, what was that? Okay. Uh. Anyway, what is up guys? There we go. That's much better. Welcome to a different type of video. Today I'm going to be talking about uh, clickbaity GTA YouTubers. There's a plethora of, of clickbait videos regarding GTA. And it's a, a big problem that's been running rampant in the community of GTA. And one YouTuber that really stuck out to me, his name was like er Ericus, Ericus, er Ericus. I don't fucking know. Some shit like that. And basically, he posts these videos of secret, you know, how to find this secret stuff. You know, up here, here's one. Here's one on the screen here. He posts this stuff on how to find secret stuff. But then when you click on the video and actually watch it, you can clearly tell that it's fake. And people, if you know the GTA games inside out, you know that it's a mod. It's very clear that it's a mod. So today, let's react to one of the videos. I decided, fuck it. Let's react to one of the videos. You know? So yeah. Here we go. Without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, okay, okay. Red flag. Before we even start the video, you can clearly tell that it's fake. One or two ways you can tell a video is clickbait. The first dead giveaway about this video is that, A, you will never see that car in-game. That is clearly a mod, and you can tell. Compare that detail of that car to any other car in the game, and you can clearly tell that that car is a mod. It is a model replacement for I don't know what car, probably the Infernus, but you can clearly tell that it's a freaking mod. The second giveaway is if they have an arrow pointing to something in the thumbnail, like a red arrow, it's most likely clickbait. But that's enough rambling. Let's actually view the video instead of just judging based off the thumbnail. Okay, starting off pretty normal. They're going to the police station in downtown in San Fierro. All right. It's pretty basic so far. Um, there should be a cop. You see that little little booth right there? There should be a cop in there. There's no cop, so right away, as you can see, he has five stars. Normally, when you go in there, you get two stars. You don't get five stars. And also, there's FIB agents. Look at the number. Then again, he does have five stars. But look at what weapon they're carrying. Normally, they carry the SMG. They are using the M4, which is normally used by the Army. Oh, there's one of them. Okay, one of them had an SMG. All right. Um... Okay, he's just... Okay, now they have SMGs. Well, they have SMGs and M4s, but they're not supposed to have M4s. They're supposed to only have SMGs. You can see the car back there. Back there in the yellow. And this, um... So, yeah. There's the car right there. You blatantly tell that it's modded in. As you can see. And, oh, I guess it's bulletproof. You know, <sighs> wait on. Okay, he's he's got it in. Yep. It's it's you. At this point, it it's a done deal. He has five stars. Normally, you'd only have two stars, but I guess let me let me skip let me skip ahead in the video. See what's. What's going on here? Wow. Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and stop it right there. It's clear that this is a mod. And, yeah. Now, this is just one of many fake videos on his channel. So far, I've only watched. I was reading the comments, and most of them were, you know, this is a mod, and 
you know, bro, what's the name of that mod? You know, trying to be slick with it, you know? Here are a few of the comments that people left on the video. And I'm just trying to think of what the thought process of the, the guy was. Not sure if he's trolling or not, but from the looks of it, I think he actually thinks that people are going to fall for this. And I bet a small percentage of people do um, fall for the clickbait. But yeah, that's just one of the videos. He has a whole plethora of YouTube videos. Now, prior to this video, I actually did watch um, about one or two of his videos uh, prior to making this video. And nonetheless, I will say they are entertaining. They're misleading, but they're pretty entertaining to watch. You know, watch him showcase the different mods that the game has offered. There's thousands of mods. Um, but yeah, I actually have another one. It's called How to Find Secret Orange Gangster in GTA San Andreas Secret Mission. That sounds like a pretty authentic and real video. Doesn't it sound real? It looks real. Look at the thumbnail. It's got the guy. It's got the orange gangster. So it must. It must be real. There's no way that it could be fake. Hey, what's going on? Except that it's fake. But that's enough of me talking. I'm rambling. Video time. Let's go. Oh, before I start, the video is 7 minutes and 20 seconds long. I don't think I'll be watching the whole shit, because let's face it, I didn't watch the other one. <laughs> let's go. Now, one red flag, right off the bat, if you, it, it, you can't hear the dialogue, because I'm talking, but I'm going to replay the clip for you all, and show you the first thing wrong with this video. Now, as you notice, he received a phone call which did not have any dialogue. That's because this is not a real mission. This is a user created mission that was created using uh, San Andreas Do Your Own Mission, which is self explanatory. You can create your own mission, your own, you know, script, you script your own mission in the game, and other people can play it. Now, one way to tell that a mission is a do-your-own mission is if there's no dialogue whenever the characters speak and there's only text. So, yeah, that's one way. Also, the guy in the thumbnail, you know, the dude with the orange hat and stuff, that's actually an artwork for a beta version of OG Lo. You know, the dude that wanted to be a rapper? Here, I'll just play a video. And I'ma kick a little something like this Hey yo, when I come through, open the place You don't want me to come with a gun in your face I spit a hotter than anybody in the yo, world could do That it's shit like that sucks Damn Damn, my shit was whack Yeah, it really was, Loke I'm actually gonna show the end of the video That, you know, people clicked on it for the mod i'm actually going to show the um final part or you know give a quick summary whatever but basically yeah i'm pretty much done with this i've already um pointed out the key elements to spotting a fake gta video uh or i've already busted the myth busted this video i've exposed it it's been exposed exposed um but yeah i'm gonna play the rest of the video or play the important part and um yeah basically so basically cj has to go out to palomino creek and kill orange brother you know in the mission orange brother so basically you go out there and you know his his men kill try to kill cj and stop him but in the end you kill orange brother so you go in collect a thing i don't i don't know and drive off i don't know the video literally cuts off with CJ driving a car. There's not even an outro. You have six stars and you have to escape, I guess. I don't I don't fucking know. That's basically the whole mission. 
now like I said before, his videos aren't, I'm not saying that they're not entertaining, they're just not real, it's just fake man, you know, it's just unauthentic and it's, it's misleading and dishonest, but nonetheless, they're still entertaining, you know, if you want to see um, some good DYOM missions or dioms do your own missions you know then you watch some of his videos i don't know how many dyom mission or videos he's made but you know those are a few people used to upload lots of uh dyom missions um and they were pretty entertaining i saw some that were pretty interesting but yeah this one was interesting as far as a dyom is for a secret in a game like this it's fake not so good but for entertainment purposes you know yeah now if you like to see mods being showcased or DIY sorry I had to burp or DIYOM missions you know being showcased then by all means watch his videos but just ignore the title in the thumbnail because they're not it's not you know it's not real but yeah, um, basically, yeah, that's about it. Now that's just one of many channels that upload clickbait GTA videos. You know, the more popular ones are Mr. Boss for the Win, Mad Carl, Mad CJ, and you know, um, <clears throat> the the one. You know, the one that uploads the. GTA 6 videos, you know, <laughs> Sernando, him, I didn't want to say his name, but Sernando, he's one of them, then again, I think his channel got deleted, I don't know, but yeah, that's, that's just a few of the clickbait YouTubers, I uh, don't really have much else to say, um, except for, uh, you can follow my Instagram, I haven't posted on there in a minute, and I need to, to start um, posting on there I might plug this video on my Instagram but uh, yeah um, go hit my Instagram hit squad underscore J um, on Instagram I don't have any other social media that's really it but yeah go follow my uh, Instagram it'll be in the link and uh, yeah that's about it see you Thank you, hey yo, met a hoe named Sonya Say hey baby doll, let a nigga get on ya She was with it but one thing She had one leg and walked with a cane I couldn't tell cause he was sitting real